Hey everyone, welcome back to the Awesomer Pop channel. Look at these soft, fluffy looking marshmallows. And the best part about them? They're super colorful. Well, actually, the best part about them should be the taste. And I'll do a taste test later and give a more detailed explanation. But these are delicious and super fun to make. So stick around if you want to learn how to make these mini rainbow marshmallows. Okay, so here are all the ingredients you'll need to make your fluffy marshmallows. You'll need a cup of sugar. You'll need one and a half teaspoons of vanilla extract. You'll need three tablespoons of water. You'll need a quarter cup of corn syrup. And you'll need to bloom three tablespoons of gelatin, so let's start with that. You just want to give this a mix until the powder dissolves. You're actually going to be putting this in the microwave again later, so you don't need to go crazy with this. Alright, now in a pot, add the sugar, and the corn syrup, add in the water as well. Now you want to heat this up until your corn syrup sugar mixture reaches 240 degrees Fahrenheit. And make sure you mix this up while everything's heating up. Alright, it's at the right temperature so we can move on. So the gelatin we bloomed earlier, put it in the microwave for 20 to 30 seconds. And you should get a liquid like this. Start by pouring that into the stand mixer. Now pour in the corn syrup sugar mix. And then you're going to keep mixing until you get a white creamy mixture. It'll take about 4 to 5 minutes. By the way, if you don't have a stand mixer at home, no worries. A hand mixer will work just fine too. Alright, once you have something that looks like this, you can pour in the vanilla extract. And then you're going to mix again until the marshmallow mix turns super fluffy. Right now it's still a bit runny. Alright, there we go. That looks much better. Now we have to separate our marshmallow mix into different bowls so that we can make a bunch of different colors. I'll be making six different colors today, so give me a minute while I separate the mix. By the way, this marshmallow sets pretty quickly, so it might be pretty difficult to mix the colors if you just leave the marshmallow out. Easiest way to go about it is to microwave your bowl for like 15 to 20 seconds. That'll melt the marshmallow a bit and you can easily mix in your colors. Since it's much easier to microwave those smaller bowls, I'll just mix what's in the stand mixer bowl to make our first color. The marshmallow hasn't set yet, so I should be able to mix this pretty easily. There we go! This is going to be a pretty sticky project, so keep that in mind. Alright, now let's pour the red marshmallow mix into a piping bag. Cut the tip. Now bring out a large tray and cover it with cornstarch. Create a nice cornstarch layer. Okay. That looks good. Now just squeeze out a line. I'll make another line. Perfect. Now let's make our orange marshmallow. Mix it up. Do the same and squeeze out a couple of lines. I went ahead and made yellow as well. Squeeze the marshmallow out. Went ahead and made green too. Yep. 
gears blue. And here's purple. All right. Now you want to cover the top with cornstarch as well. You want to cover the marshmallows completely so that they don't get sticky. Use your hands to spread the cornstarch around. There we go. Now we just want to make bite-sized pieces, so use your knife to cut the marshmallows. I'm making mine mini, but feel free to make them bigger if you want. Once you have everything cut up, toss your marshmallows in the cornstarch one more time. Now you can't really see the colors with all this coating, so grab a sieve and shake all of the excess starch off the marshmallows. This part will take some time, but do your best to shake everything off. Pretty much, at the end, you just want to see a thin coating of cornstarch. Once you have that, just let your marshmallow sit for a bit and you'll start to see the colors. There we go. Now pour the marshmallows into a bowl and you just made mini rainbow marshmallows. Pretty simple, right? And I'm feeling these right now and they feel super soft and not sticky at all. Alright, so here's a closer look. Let me squeeze this. Look how fluffy this marshmallow is. It's time to give this a try. It looks too good. Wow! It's super sweet, soft, and it's got a nice chewy texture in the beginning, and then it just melts in your mouth. I actually like these better than the marshmallows I buy at the store. And at the market, most likely, you can only find white ones, so it's nice that we can make ours colorful too. These are perfect snacks to make any time of the year. They're absolutely delicious and super cute. Give this a try and let us know how it goes. Well, now I'm gonna eat some more. Mm -mm -mm. Wow, that is really, really good. Awesome pop fans! Thank you so much for watching. We can't do this without you. If you're new to the channel and became a fan, click that subscribe button for more awesome stuff. And if you want to be the first person to watch our next video, hit that notification bell to have a chance. See ya!